Hi, in this tutorial, we'll learn about ROS2 parameters. We'll explain how nodes and parameters are related. Then, finally, we'll explore some parameters related command. Here, on the right hand side, we have the ROS2 commands which we will use in this video. If you already know ROS1, then on the left hand side, you can find the corresponding ROS1 commands. In a simple word, ROS2 parameters are default configuration setting. Example, there can be parameters of PID gain value of the robot control. In ROS2, each node maintain its own parameter. Also, a node can store parameters as integer, float, boolean, etc. Let's do practical and explore a ROS2 parameter. We will just split the screen into some parts. Next, we'll run Turtle Sim node executable. We'll just type ROS2 run, then Turtle Sim, and then the executable, just Turtle Sim node. Just press enter. Now uh, I will just minimize it. And here, just type ROS2 H. Here we will use this param command which will provide various parameter related subcommands. Just type ROS2 param hyphen h. So here uh, you can find that these all are the commands de delete, describe, dump, get, list, set. These all are the commands which we can use. Uh, of the ROS2 param command. So firstly we will try this list command. Just type ROS2 param then list press enter and here you can observe that this tut this this turtle sim node which is having this parameter background B G R uh, Next, we'll try this get command. So, we'll get the parameter. Here, just type ROS2 param and get then hyphen h. Here, in the usage, you can observe we have to type ROS2 param get then the node name and parameter name. So just type ROS2 param get then the node name Strattle So just type uh, then press double tab. Next uh, we'll use this parameter parameter B. So just type background B. And you can you can observe that the output is integer value is 255 so the value of background B parameter is 255 similarly you can explore other parameters let's change this value uh, of this parameter background B so we'll use this set command so we'll go for the help and here in the usage you can observe we have to type ROS2 param set then the node name parameter name and the value so just type ROS2 param set node name then the parameter name and value let's try uh, let's give this value 0 so keep it always on top and press enter and here you can observe that the background of the status in GUI has changed because we changed the parameter so you can change uh, the parameters and they are dynamically configurable next uh, we'll pass value 
just press enter and here you can see our turtle sim node executable this uh, one crashed so because we passed the invalid value it should we should pass integer values and we pass this uh, floating point value so you should take care of the data type now uh, we'll again run the turtle sim node executable keep it always on top next we'll try this delete command which will delete parameter so we'll go for the help and here in the usage you can observe we have to type ros2 param delete then the node name and the parameter name so instead of set uh, we'll write delete just press enter and uh, we deleted the parameter successfully now if you run ros2 param list so just run it again you can observe that now that background b parameter is gone so that was the role of the delete command next close the turtle sim and we'll again uh, start it because that parameter was gone so now we'll have all those parameters next we'll try the set command and we'll set that value to minus 20 now we got the response that setting the parameter failed so when we pass minus 20 it failed even minus 20 is an integer but we got the error that it is outside of range even we know that the value of the blue color should be between 0 to 255 but how the parameter know uh, let's find out so we'll use this describe command so just go to the help and type ros to param describe hyphen h now here in the usage you can observe we have to type this node name and the parameter name just change this set to para to describe and press enter now here you can observe uh, the information regarding this background b parameter this type and we have this constraint so minimum value is 0 and the maximum value is 255 and that is the reason why it was not accepting the minus 20 value so you can also give constraints you can also save node parameter and then reuse it for the next time you run the node. So uh, I will just change this background B value to 20. And now uh, we will save the current parameters. So we have to use this uh, dump command which will dump the parameter of a node to a YML file. So just type pros to param dumb hyphen h in the usage you can observe we have to type ros2 param dumb then the node name so instead of set i'll write dumb so we have saved the parameter to turtlesim.yml file just go to the home now open this file turtlesim.yml and here you can observe that it contains the uh, 
parameter now we'll run turtle sim but with the suit parameter so we'll just close it and now in order to apply this parameter you have to type ros2 run turtle sim then turtle sim node and then we have to pass the optional parameter this ros orgs and then parameter file and then the file location just press double tab and press enter and here you can observe that now this uh, when we launch this turtle sim it's not in blue color it's in green color so uh, that's it for this tutorial i hope you like this video and learn something new if you like this video please give us like and subscribe our channel and keep learning